in the world of training, we're always trying to create the scenario as close to the realistic conditions that soldiers will meet on operations. Currently, all we have are pop-up targets and moving targets. With this thing, it's an interesting target to engage. Make the target interesting and the soldiers will hit it because they'll want to hit it. I've done one tour of Afghanistan and two of Iraq. Today, when we first started off this morning, it was a lot bit difficult to get the grips actually firing at it, but I actually enjoyed the dry shooting. Cut that front! Just for the training value, it would actually add some realism to us. Right now, we've got a lot of younger soldiers that haven't been on tours, so they're only used to normal static ranges or moving ranges with single targets. Cut that front! You know, we don't know out there where the enemy's going to go. Cut that! You can program them to follow specific paths, so maybe patrol some area or move randomly within some area just to kind of mill around, do whatever people do. And you set them up to react. So for example, when one is hit, the others will react to that shot by scattering and running for cover. Providing a confusing, challenging scenario for the shooters and force decision-making and judgment skills during training.